Sandy, how are you? I'm well, thank you. How are you? I'm really good. Now, um, I'm the district nurse and they've asked me to just come along and make sure that you're happy to use your pen. All right? Okay. Would you like me to show you once more how to do that? Yeah, I'm, I'm really not... I'm not sure how I actually get this stuff, this little thing, into here. All right. Well, would you like me to show you or would you like me to walk you through doing it yourself? Um, I think you better just show me one more right. time, please, and then I'll do it. Okay, so what we're going to do is make sure that we've got the right oh, insulin. Yeah, let me see. Yep, right insulin, mm -hmm. the one that the doctor's ordered for you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Just need to check the expiry date on it. Yeah. Okay, good. So if it's a little bit expired, is that okay? No, if once it's expired, you'll need to throw it out. But I would think you're on about um, you're 12 or 15 units. Around that, yes. Yeah. So I would think if you're having probably 12 or 15 units twice a day, mm -hmm. that you would use this cartridge okay. before it expires. So if there's still some left in it, it doesn't matter, I throw it out. You just throw it out. Okay. And you have, just need to throw it out, of course, into a sharps container. Oh, yes, I've got one of them. Good, they gave yep. you one to let. Good. Yes. So what we're just going to do is get an alco wipe mm -hmm. and wipe the end of it before we load it actually into our little pen here. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll do that first. And we'll just give it a little minute to dry. Okay. Okay. Good. And then we get our pens. All right. So then what we need to do is unscrew this piece. So the top off the base. Yes. Like that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. Get your, get, now make sure that this end here goes in that way. Because mm -hmm. when you put it into the pen, mm -hmm. we're going to dial from this end and that's going to push that plunger forward. Okay. All right. So that goes in there. That goes on there like that. Okay. All right? Mm -hmm. And it's now ready to use. Mm -hmm. So you then get one of your... <coughs> uh, just check the expiry date on it. Mm -hmm. Yep. Take the cap off. Now, just need to be a little Ooh. bit... Oh. Yeah, really quite Ooh. sharp in there. So hang I on. I better not let the grandchildren play with that. Absolutely. No, please don't let your grandchildren. So pop that in there and, again, spin it on. Mm -hmm. So that now gives us our, our um, needle yes. on the end. Yes. All right, mm -hmm. but there's still a safety cap there. Mm -hmm. All right, you would then dial up the insulin. So how many units are you on? Twelve. Twelve. So we'll. Is dial that a lot? No, not really. No, you can take a lot more than that. And of this mm -hmm. particular type, not a great deal. Mm -hmm. So we've dialed it to twelve units. So the twelve has to be where that little line is. Yes. Is that see right? See the little line there. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's great. Good. Yep. And okay. we're going to take the end off. Now, just remembering under there's something really sharp. Oh. All right. Oh, it's very long, isn't it? Yeah, but it's not actually going to go... It's only going to go into your subcutaneous tissue. Remember the diabetic... Edge? Subcutaneous tissue? So the what? tissue what? just under the skin. Oh, yes, I remember that now. Yes. Oh, oh, I see. The diabetic nurse told me about this when I was in hospital, but it was, you know... It's a lot to take in, It was in, a little bit it? fuzzy. I mm. think that's why they sent me around to, to show you again. Because mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you're due to go and see the diabetic educator? Yes, I'm going to see her on Friday. Great. All right. Well, you might... I'll be able to show her how I can do it. That'd be good. And so I've just brought along this little demonstration tummy here. Mm -hmm. So at uh, anywhere between 45 and 90 degrees, mm -hmm. so 90 degrees being straight in, yes. you pop it into your tummy. Oh, wait, do I have to clean that? Well, your tummy, well, you would have got out of the shower or just make sure you haven't been eating donuts and there's no sugar on your oh, fingers. Oh, okay. All right. Don't, I'm not allowed to eat donuts anymore. I know you're not. Good on you, you've oh, changed the diet. Good, so we just go in. 90 degrees, yes. you don't have to go all the way in. Mm -hmm. That's about far enough. And then we just press the button. Take right. it out. Do I, now do I scrub it? No, certainly don't have to scrub it. Oh, okay. There is another way that you can do it mm -hmm. if you want to. So you would dial up the 12 mm -hmm. units. You can pull the skin slightly across, go in at 90 degrees, mm -hmm. press the button, mm -hmm. pull it out, let it go, and this, it's called Z tracking. Okay. Goes back across. Did is there one way that's better than the other? No, whichever one really suits you to begin with, and it might just be easier for you to do the straight in so. one to begin with. I think so. All mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. And then what we need to do, because you're doing this yourself, mm -hmm. you, I usually just leave it on the table like that. In mm -hmm. the hospital, we don't recap, okay. but lots of patients in their home setting. Because I think they told me I can use that needle several times. That's absolutely mm -hmm. correct, but you might just want to put the cap back on yes. it. Put the safety guard back on, mm -hmm. and then you need to pop it into the fridge. Okay. Do I put this cover back on, or that just gets in the bin now? Well, once you've got the needle on, it's really hard to get the cover back on. Oh, so okay. the cover's really for when the needle <coughs> comes off. So you really just pop it in the fridge. Lots of people pop it in like the, you know, where the cheese 
Oh, chocolate used to sit. Yes, oh, used to yes, sit in that little part. Oh, and this is telling me how much how many liquid units? I've got left. Yes. Units, you said? Yes, so we measure your insulin in oh, units. Oh, so that 12 that, you di- that I'm on here, that's units? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Lovely, thank you. That's my pleasure. It was thank lovely you. to meet you. You too, thank you. Good Will luck. I see you again? Um, probably, you'll probably see me a couple of times every now and then, but if you're managing at home well on your own, with okay. your diabetic educator, yes. we'll just drop in when you need us. Okay. Lovely, thank you very much. Lovely to meet you. You too. Bye. Bye.